anybody going to ask me, what happened to your body, church? What happened to your body, church? What happened to somebody, church? I know my name. You can ask me if you forget. Hey, can we please focus on me? Uh, by the way, he's church. Yes, thank you, Caboose. She knows. He is the mean one. Thank you, Caboose. See, he is mad. Now he'll just stare at me until I stop talking. Then, when he thinks I am done talking, then he will start talking again. Okay, I was talking to Gary and- Told you so! God damn it! Classic church. Let's talk a countess movie! Run, 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 run! Hey, wait, wait! I would make an excellent ambidastor. Because I am very shy! Get away from me, freak! I think I will call him Crunchbite. Who are you talking to? Holy shit! <laughs> he has not tried to bite me at all. <laughs> since he bit me the first time. I think I might need a tetanus shot. Exactly what he said right before he bit me. I think Blarg meets Blarg. me. Blarg. Or Blarg. apples. Blarg. Guys, Blarg. apples Blarg. must be Blarg. the name of his cat. Quick, quick, is, is Apple stuck in a tree? I will call the fire department. I think he might be saying things telepathically. I just heard something in my head. was a voice saying, Blarg, 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 Hog. That wasn't in your head, Caboose. He just said that. You're just so dumb, you're lagged a few seconds behind us. By the time your brain figures out what it's heard, it feels like it's already happened. That's not true. Tucker, the enormous alien doesn't speak our language. Speaking slowly is not gonna help. What? I'm talking to Caboose. Oh. I don't understand. Are, are, are you hungry? Tucker, are you hungry? Are you cold? What? No. Do you need a blanket? Tucker, do you want some hot dogs in a blanket? Damn it. No, Caboose, I'm not cold. I don't want a hot dog, and if you put mustard in my fucking sheets again, I'm gonna kill you. Okay, gargantuan alien. Now that we have decided to keep you, you need a real name. I vote for Fluffy. Fluffy? Fluffy! The alien that only loves! Alright, there is no way this is gonna work. Yeah, it is. We got visual aids and everything. Where the hell did you get those? We made them. Turns out Caboose's gun didn't have any bullets. It was loaded with crayons. Unless you got your English to blog blog dictionary, I don't think you got a choice, now do you? I have one of those. If I threw it out, it didn't have many pictures. What's he take now, Andy? Look, guys, if you want me to translate for you, you can't keep asking me every four seconds, What's he saying now, Andy? What's he saying now? I'm gonna tell you what he's saying. That's my freaking job. That's what he said? That's a weird thing to say. Oh, 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 I hope we meet a cleric along the way. None of us knows how to heal. He's a healer. Oh, good. <laughs> Not really. They eat their wounded. <laughs> Just like chiropractors. Okay, so, um, Tucker is the fighter, uh, Crunchbite is the healer, and I am the powerful and intelligent wizard, Morphubex. You're the good-looking and stealthy archer. A bow and arrow? I don't have any arms, you freaking moron! That is what makes you so stealthy. This is going to be the best party ever. You to change your underwear at least once a day. Tucker, that goes double for you. What? I'm the cleanest guy here. No, it goes double for you because now you're in charge of changing caboose as well. Okay. Are we at a get kill to the end of the plan? Is we here already? Yes, uh, before now. That's what already means, Caboose. Oh, then just, yes. I was helping watch. I was the bait? I thought you did a very good job. Maybe he just wants to steal your breath. I'm just glad I brought my mittens. Oh no. Yep. Doesn't look good. No, no, no. I mean, I lost some of my mittens. Um, we have to go back. Turks! Wyoming? Connecticut! It's true. I have a first place ribbon in doing nothing. It's the same ribbon as last place. It's purple. She chased after Wyoming. Tex? Yeah. Wyoming? Yes. Massachusetts. Uh, it was dark and swampy. I wasn't scared at all. And because the uh, glowing sword turned out to be a, a, a glowing key, or it's a key all the time, and when you stick it in people, it unlocks their death. God damn, man. I would love to live in your world for about ten minutes. Or maybe it runs on solar power. No. 
Why would solar power make him sick? Is he a Republican? He ate all my food and just threw it up. Could have just thrown it on the floor and cut out the middleman. Yeah, plus now he's moody as hell. I went to ask him if he's feeling better and he practically bit my goddamn head off. I bet he just would have thrown up your head later. And then you could just put it right back on. I'm gonna go take a vitamin. Oh, don't bother. It's too late for you anyway. I just finished thinking about something and didn't start thinking about anything else. I can't. Well, why not? Oh, because uh, I am allergic to things that I don't want to do. <coughs> Coughing. Tell us, Doc. We can take it. Your friend is... Dying? Oh, no. No, he's not dying. He just says... No chance to live. I knew it. I think I need to stay here and guard this rock. From Tucker. Because I'm pretty sure that's how all this started. Wait, if Tucker is contagious, I do not want to catch pregnancy. What happened to you? Rapido. Antes de que se vuelvan, cabe una gallero y entierme, por favor. Eddie, you turned into a real boy. I see, Eddie, now we can go fishing, and you don't have to be the bait anymore, and we can hiking, and we can go camping, and you don't have to be the fire anymore, and we can ride it together, and now we can hold hands, and we can fly kites, and we can play tag, and we can drink horse juice together. Hey, Caboose! You hear something behind you! I do? I wonder what's causing it. Double yoink. Eddie? Oh my god! Eddie! You're dead! Doctor, help! My second best friend is dead! Fix him? Whoa, 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 Caboose. What happened? Who's dead? Eddie! Eddie is dead! Look! Okay, that's disgusting. Dr. Doc, please help him. First Tucker dies and now Andy! Tucker isn't dead, he's pregnant. It's not mine, we weren't even going steady. Stop that. I was just standing outside the base and someone told me to turn around and when I did, Andy... Whoa, wait, who told you to turn around? I don't know, but they were very helpful. And let me guess, when you turned back around, Andy was gone. Yes, he was... God. Caboose, better go boil some water. How could you think of soup at a time like this?